Hey y'all, in today's video, I'm gonna be sharing with you all how I got a ton of volume, even though my hair was blown out and straight. For me, I love volume, not just when my hair is curly, but even when it's in this state. And so I was obsessed with trying to figure out how to get more volume. I feel like the last time I got my hair blown out, it went so straight so quickly. And I don't know, maybe it's just the adjustment from going from the curly fro to the straight, but I absolutely was missing my volume like crazy. And I thought I'd share with you guys some of the tips and tricks I did that kind of helped me get more volume. So as you guys could see at the beginning of the video, my hair is starting off in a wrapped state and I'm just taking down the wrap. And I also did a couple of large perm rods at the top. If you have rollers, like the old school roller set rollers that are large, I'd use that as well. Be careful to not use a roller that's too small because sometimes it can create more of a curl than you'll want. And I didn't want too much of a Shirley Temple type curl, but rather I just wanted to create a bump up in volume. I also wrap my hair in one direction and style it in the opposite direction of the way it's wrapped. And I found that combing it out in that opposite direction really created a lot more volume and gave me the illusion of really, 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 really full hair. And this is a great tip if you have naturally more fine hair, I'd recommend. So if you're going to wrap your hair to the right, style it where it falls to the left. And going in that opposite direction of the way it's wrapped creates that volume as well because your hair got used to being wrapped overnight in the opposite direction. As you guys can see, I was already getting a lot more volume and then what I just did was made sure that my curls kind of laid and fell in a way that didn't look too crazy. Sometimes when it first comes out the wrap, you can have a little bit of spaciness or some parts. So that's just what I'm doing here is checking to make sure that all of my curls are combed down and combed out in a way where they fall nicely. And that is pretty much it, you guys. This is how I got tons of volume with my hair in its straightened state. Hopefully this was helpful and thanks for watching.